Hey everyone, welcome to Data with Zach. On this channel, I help demystify data and software careers through educational videos. In this video, we're gonna be talking about the future. Where are the trends going for data engineering and how can data engineers get ahead of the game and be more competitive in the future? So let's, let's dive into it. So the, the first thing that I think is happening right now, a very, very common, very big trend I'm seeing is around data velocity. There is a big push for a lot of real-time analytics in a lot of places, and that means that data engineers really should be skilling up on streaming data pipelines. If you want your data in real time and really quickly, then really some things that would be important to learn are Scala and the framework Apache Flink. Apache Flink is a wonderful real-time data processing framework that I highly recommend people learn. Another big trend I'm seeing is around data quality. Data quality is a huge deal because people are realizing that machine learning kind of sucks if the data quality isn't very high. So data engineers who know anomaly detection, who know uniqueness checks, who know null checks, and know how to like run these checks on their data sets before writing to production, that is going to be a very in-demand skill. Some tools and libraries to look into here is it's a library by Amazon called DQ that I highly recommend. And there's also one called Great Expectations, a library called, an open source library called Great Expectations that I also highly recommend. Uh, a third thing, a third trend that I'm seeing is there's gonna be more cloud offerings, like platforms like Snowflake and BigQuery are making things that used to be really, really challenging, like a lot simpler. They're just a SQL query now and it's like a lot easier and it's making a lot of, data engineering tasks kind of go back to their roots in like the relational database world of like SQL and data modeling and really learning how to leverage these platforms and understanding them is also going to be a huge win for a lot of data engineers in their career. And the final trend that I'm seeing is around privacy. Um, data privacy is a huge deal. There's a bunch of new laws like GDPR and CCPA. And one of the trickiest parts of these laws is there's a thing called the right to be forgotten. And this part allows customers to request their data be deleted, like all of their data be deleted by a company. And so that means that data engineers need to understand how to tag their data for PII and personally identifiable information. They also need to know how to anonymize data to hold on to data that isn't PII so that we can have long-term analytics as well and unblock data science if they're looking at long-term trends. So those are kind of the big things I'm seeing in trends in data engineering. Do you see any other trends? Drop a comment and let's discuss. And also don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you very much.